most horrific night in my entire life, you know. Um, um, a lot of friends that aren't are no longer here, you know. Um, a lot of families that are horribly devastated. You know, I, it's something I don't really like to talk about anymore. It's been almost 10 years, and no matter what I say, it's never going to make anybody feel any better about it, and sometimes it might make them even feel worse, so I, I'd really rather not say too much, you know what I mean? It's out of respect for, for the people that have passed, you know? Every night, I pray for the families and, and for the people that lost their lives and the people that were injured, you know? It's not like something that I forget about, you know? This was a life-changing event for everyone, you know? Um, it's not like a day goes by and I don't think about it, you know what I mean? I, I, I wish, you know, I, I could put it away sometimes for a little bit, you know I mean? but I can't, and I've tried, you know, just to... But then there's a part of me that, out of respect, you know, I never want to forget, you know what I mean? But, I don't know. I know how horrible I feel for losing some really close friends. And this is almost 10 years ago, you know? Mm -hmm. um, I know how horrible I feel knowing there's a nine-year-old kid that was the son of my guitar players that will never meet his dad. You know, I can't imagine how people feel who, like, lost their wife, lost their son, lost their daughter, you know, lost their husband or whatever. I can't even imagine the depth of their pain. 